Hello guys, welcome back to TV Box B. <laughs> I'm so sorry about that. Welcome back to TV Box B and today I'm gonna show you on how to connect your Android box to your Wi-Fi. Well, this is a very simple tutorial, but guys, believe me, I get a lot of queries on this one. So here is how to connect your Android box to your effing Wi-Fi. <laughs> okay, so um, right now you can see I'm on the home screen of my device and in order to connect to internet, you can go on to your settings, which is the two cogs right here. Okay, you can click on it, click OK on it, and you can see the network option here, right here. So the network option is from where we can connect to the internet, but before I go ahead and connect to the internet, I will just go back to the home screen. So in case you don't have these two cogs, the settings cogs, on your home screen what you can do is just go on to your apps which i can do by going into the circle with six dots right here so i'm going into my apps so let me click on apps and then in here you can go on to your settings so here are the android settings right here you can see so these are the android settings if i and if i click ok on it i have selected it let me press ok on my remote and you can see it brings me to the same interface um, which I got when I clicked on the two cogs on the home screen. So I'm back to the home screen and let me go ahead and click on the two cogs. So clicking OK on it and you can see we're back to the same interface and uh, which you can get via the settings in your app. So in here in order to connect to your Wi-Fi what you need to do is you just need to go on to the network option here you can see. So go on to network and click OK on it. So inside network you can see there are three options. There's Wi-Fi, there's Ethernet, there's VPN. Uh, I will just click OK on Wi-Fi. And when I click OK on Wi-Fi, it shows me these options that these are the available networks. There's uh, Django, there is 4G, there's Garchas and whatever. So uh, uh, the Django is mine. I'm clicking OK on it. I'm uh, definitely, you need to click on your own internet connection. You cannot use your neighbor's internet connection of course okay so let me click on my django clicking ok on it it says enter your damn password okay i'm entering my password da, 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 da. four two and a hash okay so i have entered the password for my wi-fi and yes one more thing that if you don't have a keyboard type remote i am using a keyboard type remote which is all the keys which is all the letters on it so i'm using and i'm directly inputting my password but in case you don't have of course you can use this on-screen keyboard and if you have numbers in your password you can go into this onto this option which is a question mark and one two three if, I, if you click on this you will see all the symbols and the numbers too so after you enter uh, the password, just go on to this arrow, which is green, or you can just press OK on your remote and press it. It says connecting to my Wi-Fi, which is Django. I love the Django movie, so I named my Wi-Fi. You see how crazy I am for Django. Uh, registration, OK, confirm. You can go on to confirm and press confirm. Okay, that's done. So connect it successfully. You can wait for a few seconds and it will go back to this Wi-Fi interface. And you can see in here, you can see the Django is connected. So we'll just go back to the main home screen. I'm pressing home button on my remote and going back to the home screen. So I'm back to the home screen and in order to test that we are connected to the internet, I will just go onto my apps and then I will go on to the browser. Okay, so I'm clicking OK on browser. So I'm in my browser and you can type in anything in the address bar at the top. So you can type in google.com, you can type in microsoft.com or anything you want. And uh, if it displays that web page, that means you are connected to the internet. So I will just go ahead and type in apkmirror.com. I use APK Mirror a lot. It has a lot of apps that we can download, of course, onto our Android box. So apkmirror.com, clicking OK on my remote. It has loaded apkmirror.com. Okay, that means we are connected to the internet, baby. Okay, so that's it for this video, guys. It's a very short tutorial in case you ever get confused as to how to connect to internet. This tutorial will be a lifesaver, dude. So that's it for this video guys and I will be back with more awesome videos that will help you out to get the best out of your Android box, to get the best out of your 
Android devices. Okay? And you are going to love the content that we are going to produce, that we are going to upload in the coming weeks. So stay tuned to my channel. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel. You can subscribe right now by clicking on the subscribe button in the middle of the screen and confirm your subscription. Okay, guys, I love you all. Okay, then take care. Bye-bye.